Hello, happy Monday, Dog Shep. I'm not reading what you just typed out loud. <laughs> but hi, Dog Shep. And Captain, you needed you a Moxie stream. I'm so good. I was so glad. Not I'm so good. I'm horrible, but I'm so glad. Oh no, I'm going to be a little tongue tied and weird today, I think. Um, first off, you might notice the music's a little different. It's going with the theme of this new island we're starting. Let me know if it's too loud or too quiet. We're going to be starting, hi Dog Shep, a new game. Uh, I don't know if you guys saw in my Discord, I was really inspired by Girly Gamers Animal Crossing. Well, I got to get rid of that nose right away. I was really inspired by Girly Gamers Animal Crossing Island. I want to see if we can recreate Pelican, Stan Pelican Town from Stardew Valley in Dinkum. Hi Charlotte! Hope everything's fine with you. I do have my cough still, you guys. I don't know what has triggered my allergies again. So it's been a little, a little difficult to breathe and talk. We're gonna figure it out. <clears throat> Hi, Isabel. Hello, happy Monday. You're good. There's the girl you need it. Hi, Lorianne. Hope you're doing well today. Let's give her like hazel eyes just to be a little different. And I think we're going to go with just the regular little mouth. Maybe a little purple shirt. Hi, Positively Stitched. Hello. Hi, Juniper Whispers. You were thinking the same thing. You just wondered who was going to do it first. Love Stardew. Well, I think we should all try it. I, um, let me pull up the picture if I can do this right. Hold on. Um, let me go to my Discord. I posted an idea of what I had for it in Discord. Let me get this open. I'm trying to remember how to do the things. So here's what I was thinking. <laughs> I'm not sure if it'll work. Hi, Spec. Hello. Happy. Is it Monday evening for you or wee hours of Tuesday morning for you and Aunt Captain now? I'm not sure. Hi, Hippie Chick. Hello. Okay, so I kind of want to recreate Pelican Town, as well as my farm and the bus stop and the mines and stuff. But we don't have the right shaped buildings for what I want to do, so I'm just going to kind of make things work. Oh, thanks, Beck. You're so sweet. Hi, Boozy. Wow, look at everybody this morning. I should start making Monday mornings a regular stream day for me, maybe, and take Wednesdays off or something. Dog Shep. No holes, okay? We're not doing an island of just holes. Get your mind elsewhere. So I was thinking for the community center, we would use the town hall. Uh, I mean, the bank doesn't really fit in anywhere, so I thought maybe the bank could go right up against John's shop to kind of combine those two. That I, I don't know. And the tucker box is way too big for the saloon. I, we're just going to have to make these things work, though, I think. So I'm like, oh, the Tucker Box is the right shape for the Jojo Mart. But no, we don't want the Tucker Box being Jojo Mart. And I thought Franklin might be a good place for, um, what's his face? Gus. Not Gus. Gus is the saloon. I don't know. Visitor's tent will be Linus. Melvin might go where Robin's house goes. Marnie would be Irwin's barn. And none of the, you know, we're just going to use our imagination and just kind of get this whole Stardew vibe. I think that's our goal. It's 1.50 a.m. for you. Oh, oh no. So early. So we're going to call the town Pelican Town. Let me know if the music's okay. Whoops. Let's spell it right. So this is going to be a very long process, though. Pelican Town is the name of the town in Stardew Valley. The island map doesn't matter. I'm not in multiplayer. I don't know why the voice thing is showing up. Okay. Um, I'm almost tempted to get rid of every part of the map we don't need. This is like going to be a really, I was going to say obnoxious, but I meant to say a really big project, project like long term, because I want to do it kind of vanilla without spawning in items. I love using the dev commands on our multiplayer islands, but I kind of just want to do it. Just good old Dinkum. Play Dinkum and try and make something happen. Hi Fletch. 
So I don't think the island layout or any of that... Whoa, that's a crazy island. <laughs> I just said I don't think it matters, but I guess it doesn't. Because once... We're going to just put everybody off to the side. Once I start getting the dirt printer and things like that, I'm going to be filling everything in that's like water in the middle of the map. And just shape it to what we need. Oh... Girly Gamer and Jersey Games, what have you done to me that I'm thinking of doing this project? I kind of don't want to use this map, though, even though I just said it doesn't matter. Oops, oh, yes, Fletch, sorry, I forgot to talk to you. We will go stake out our towers. It might be kind of fun, though, too, with the towers. Oh, like if I had a tower that was off to the west a little more than this one is, that would be neat. Or we make an island where this one is, because this could be like Ginger Island by one tower. Another tower could be like a different part of the game. I don't know. Like Stardew Valley Expanded. Yeah, the net, you're right. We're just going to go with this one. We're going to make it make everything work. So how was everybody's weekend? Did you have a good weekend? I was very cranky this weekend. I pulled a muscle in my back Saturday doing absolutely nothing but standing up from my desk chair. And it's still a little bit messed up today, but a lot better than it was. <laughs> so I was just a cranky pants all weekend. All right, I am going to go find our towers just because it's handy to do it before time starts moving. And I like to grab lots of forageables and stuff along the way. It's just one of my favorite things to do on a new island. So we'll have some resources and fruits and things. You're quite tired. Oh, yes, yeah, Spec, you should be in bed. I've been having fun um, watching... I haven't watched full streams, but bits and pieces of your pirate island that you guys have been doing. That's been so fun to watch. I cracked up at your short, too, the other day where you got revenge. <laughs> where you're running around with the campfires. Oh my god, it was hilarious. I made my husband watch that short. Oh, Aunt Captain, I'm so sorry. I hope you're feeling better, too. And let's... Oh, it's kind of interesting how this is all connected. I just want to run and explore this because it's really kind of cool. Usually I have to do lots of swimming. Yes, you need to get your sleeps. It's been a while since you've been able to see me. I wanted to stream even earlier. Like I was ready to go about two hours ago, but I order our groceries online and Tom's off this week. Oh, we're going to grab some coconuts. I actually almost love this island layout enough that I would rather use this for another type of island. I'm not going to. We'll, we're, we're, we're just going to move, keep it for what we're doing. But look at this. I've never been able to get coconuts without having to swim before. So yeah, Tom's home this week and he went to go get the uh, groceries that I had ordered. But he didn't want me to start streaming till he was home so I could open the back. So open it. I, all right. I was going to say open the back door. That sounds very naughty. So I could open the door for him. <laughs> Hi, chocolate latte. How are you doing? Fe Hello, fellow chat dinks. That's cute. I <laughs> hope you're doing well. Oh, man, I had a rough night last night. We have tweaker neighbors. For anybody who doesn't isn't familiar with the term tweaker, they're always hopped up on whatever drugs they're taking. I want to go get more coconuts before we go find the next tower. They were up in their driveway all night talking. I finally just turned on my white noise machine and it drowned them out until someone was trying to back up a vehicle into their steep driveway. And I don't know how many guys were giving this girl directions. I just wanted to scream out the window, park it already. <laughs> that was sometime around 2, 2.30 this morning. I know, Spec. <laughs> Giggity. I like this island. It's just a fun island. Oh, hello. Um, we're going to ignore you and go this way. We'll get more bananas. I love just running around the whole island when we first started up. It's so just cool to kind of see where everything is. 
You moved out of your last house when a meth lab blew up on the street behind us. Yeah, California. I'm telling you, Boozy. I just, it's a lot. We thought these people were going to have to move a year or so ago because their family, it, the house, this house next door to us and the one behind us were owned by a trust, but they were able to sell the one behind us, which was great because that was even more of a problem house. Um, and then they used the money from that sale to pay off the taxes they owed on the house next door to us. They still don't have power. They have not had power to their house in probably eight years. <laughs> and it's just crazy, all the noise and stuff. You use white noise so you don't hear the foxes. Oh. Although I get, yeah, I use a white noise machine too, it helps. Plus Tom has um, sleep apnea, so he uses a CPAP machine. So that can be kind of loud, so the white noise machine helps drown that out as well. That's one thing about this house though. <laughs> Being in kind of a crazy neighborhood is I've learned how to tune out a lot of noise so I can sleep at night. All right, let's find that tower. I am loving these riverways, though, and stuff. It's almost a shame that we'll be destroying it all. Oh, I don't like earplugs. I've tried that. My ears just don't like having things in them. Yeah, you have a stream in seven hours, Spec. Also, I didn't do any shout outs this morning. You guys have to check out, if you haven't, check out Spec. Check out Boozy. Am I missing anybody else? Oh, Fiona, hi, I didn't see you pop in. You're so excited for this. I'm excited and a little, like, almost overwhelmed. But we're just going to take it all one step at a time. Close enough. Oh, wait. No. <laughs> No, I'm already doing the things wrong because I didn't want to anger the bird. There we go. <laughs> Jersey! So you have a good night's sleep, Spa. I hope you have a great, great stream later. Jersey, you and Girly Gamer are to blame for this. <laughs> I want to do Pelican Town. I don't know how I'm going to do it. I mean, I have a vague idea. We're going to have to use a lot of imagination. Hi, Misty. Hello. And hello. I'm sorry if I've missed anyone while I'm running around the new island. Hope you're all doing really well today. Before Dinkum, Stardew Valley was my favorite game. It's now been knocked down to number two because of Dinkum. So I thought, what fun way, you know, what better way to try and combine the two? Reaps is here, too. Hello, Reaps. You should also be in bed sleeping. <laughs> Sorry I missed your stream the last few nights, Reaps. Tom's been home, so I've just been a little bit busier. I can't hog the TV for streams all the time, but we just got rid of our cable provider, or in, yeah, cable provider, and we switched to uh, Hulu Plus for right now. So I can now watch YouTube, because I've got a Roku in the bedroom TV, so I can now watch YouTube streams while I'm lying in bed. That's gonna be awesome. So I can pull a Reaps. <laughs> Hi, Fiona. Hi, Ed Dog. Hello. Hope you're doing well. Hi, all stuffing games. So good to see you. Hope you're doing well. So many amazing people here this morning. Okay, we're going to go find the Western Tower. Yeah, I was eager to actually get started on this yesterday. I could not sit here for very long, so we'll see how long I can sit at my desk chair today. I'm just going a little out of the way to grab fruit here and there. How's, how are Nestor and the baby Jersey? And you, how are you? Sounds like she's a very good baby who's been letting you get lots of sleep, which is amazing. <laughs> not that there's anything but a very good baby, right? They're all the goodest. I'm gonna go get some more apples. <laughs> oh, that's right. I forgot about all Steph. What is, I forget the name name you like to use. I even jotted it down. I was gonna use it next time I saw you and I think I got rid of my notes. <laughs> so excited. 
see this come together. I love Stardew. I'm hoping I do it justice. We're gonna just try and do the best we can. Doxy Mom, hello. Hope you're doing all right. Hope it hasn't been too hot where you are. Yeah, we're kind of headed the right direction. No doggo cam today because they're hanging out with Tom in the living room and I'm shut in here with the door closed so I don't bother everybody. <laughs> and vice versa. Although I do love it when Tom chimes in with his two cents from the other room. Baby and Nestor are doing amazing. She slept six hours last night. <gasps> sure say she's a magical baby. That's so sweet. Yeah, and dog, I've thought about trying Minecraft. My problem is I'm not super happy. There's my tower with first person games. I just I could probably I've been tempted to try it, though, anyway. I think I could get used to it. It's hot. Oh no, stupid Florida. We're gonna be warming up here pretty soon. I think tomorrow. We shall see. I thought about using my Bodega Bay Island for this instead of starting all the way over, but you can't change your island name. And of course we had to be called Pelican Town. I should try Minecraft. I know Ozzy Nuts was talking to you about like getting a server going. Maybe if people were interested. I have never played it. Oh, I want to get stung. Thank you. Oh, I don't know if I'll get the points for that actually since we don't have the book yet. <laughs> I just like it when they throw you across the river. Oh, that's a lot of sleeping little, little furry puppies. Should I go pet the puppies? I'm gonna cross through. <laughs> Just stay sleeping. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. I figure I'll grab the red wattle. I'm not gonna grab the seeds yet, but I, I just want to at least have it so I can, when I unlock the billy can in the keg, I'll have some ready to go. I still have a few things to finish up on my other island, Arwick, as well. We will be doing that as well. I just thought, let's get this started. I'll probably be playing this one, though, mostly on stream. I don't think I'll uh, play this one when I'm not streaming or recording for it. That's a long swim. Eh, it's not that bad. Oh, there's a croc. He's swimming this way. We'll just go this way, too. You enjoy that first forever day gathering every resource available. I I felt for you and your husband, though, Booz. Oh, Boozy, did I link? I linked you, didn't I? I think so. Um, I felt so bad for your husband, though, because his game crashed and you lost everything <laughs> that he had gathered already. I'm like, oh, that's how it goes sometimes. There's a thing you need to know about Minecraft. You can choose between creative and survival. Oh, that's handy to know. Um, what was I just about to do? Oh, look at my map. Hello. We need to go south. I like it when games have a creative or survival mode. I was playing a little um, medieval dynasty this weekend. That was pretty fun. Um, I'm just, just playing that on my own. I'm not planning on streaming it, but Ozzy Nuts was streaming it and it looked really fun, so I had to try it. I noticed after playing it for a while, it had some settings you could change. It's like you didn't have to deal with weight limits and stuff. Hi, dogs. Oh, look at They're floating. They're fancy doggos. Hi, Shelly Marie. How are you? Welcome, welcome. Yeah, I'm enjoying watching 
Boozy and Mr. Boozy play together. It's really cute. Tom's still not ready to stream it or play it with me again, but he did play a little dinkum a couple times over this over the weekend. I just kind of acted like I didn't see it was happening and I'm just laying low. I don't want to scare him away. He did have a couple of questions though, which was cute. And every time he sees meat on the ground, he now yells free meat. <laughs> so I'm encouraged. And he made his rowboat. And he was fishing and he realized the fishing in this game, not that bad. Right, Isabel? Every time, like whenever Reap starts one of his new islands or somebody else starts, I always want to start a new island too. I will miss having a hang glider in vehicles though. Shelly, I'm trying to remember, are you, were you camping last week or am I confusing people again like I sometimes do? Because if you were camping, you're probably home and exhausted by now. <laughs> I'm always so tired after a trip. All right, let's head back. We're going to head back. We're just going to place things back around the docks. We just got to get the new f the new game up and going. I can't stop harvesting, though. <laughs> you had to wake up early, only slept four hours. Oh, Jersey, I'm cranky if I get four hours or less. So I'm cranky a lot. <laughs> I'm digging the Stardew Valley music. <laughs> I bought this soundtrack a year or so ago. I like to play it when I'm uh, cleaning house. It doesn't really make housework more fun, but at least the music's happy. mark some of these ore spots, but I'll wait till I find like a really big juicy one. You were camping, got home yesterday, and then Jersey kept you up till- Oh, Jersey, that's right, I saw you did a, a stream. I think it was the wee hours again for me. Hope it went well. I'm glad you were watching that. Or were you on the island with them, Shelly? That's so fun. Jersey keeping us all up late one night a week, except not me because I'm already sound asleep. <laughs> I go to bed ridiculously early. You love the Star TV music? Nice. Oh, Shelly, you only got three. If I only get three hours of sleep, I feel very shaky. All right, let's actually start to head back and stop getting distracted by all the things we can harvest. I should be getting some of these logs too. We're gonna need, need logs. Uh-oh, a little bit of a swim here. Oh no, there's a little island. Derp. Last night's stream was so good, everyone kept you up. I love it. I'll have to watch it on demand later. Okay, the wood in Minecraft is oak, birch, spruce, dark oak, jungle, acacia, cherry trees. That's a lot of wood. Giggity. All right, Fletch. I think we're going to put most of y'all just out here on the beach, just lined up. Probably just facing the water. Or we could do it... Yeah, maybe I'll put my house back there next to the teleporter and we'll just do Fletch here. Front and center. Yeah, let's tuck it back off the beach a little bit. You slept on and off today as you didn't get to sleep till 8 a.m.? Oh no, and Captain, why? I hope everything's okay. It was a fun stream. We definitely chatted a lot, and Jersey did get a little designing done. I love that, though, when it's just a lot of chatting. Oh, you all need your rest. 
They added cherry trees in the July 7th update. Yeah, I, I've been so tempted to play it. I just don't know when I'd have time. Hi, Kayla. Happy to see you here. Hope you're feeling better. I'm not going to read all of this. We all know it. I'll tell you what, we've read all of this before. Um, I'm going to put my tent back here, though. We'll make this a little space for me out here. We'll put my tent back here and then like the little workshop and cooking area in front of it. Lots of crocs will probably want to attack me every day from the river. It's going to be awesome. Once you buy it, the updates are free forever. That's nice, head dog. I like that. Hi, Angeli. Good to see you. I did, I did. It's all gonna get moved. Hi, Tamika! I haven't seen you in a while. Oh, I didn't know you were in the hospital, Tamika. So if they don't mess up your medication again, and if tonight goes okay, you're going home tomorrow? Tamika, I'm so very sorry to hear that you've been in the hospital. I was just gonna reach out to you in a little bit and send you a message just because I hadn't seen you or heard from you and was getting a little worried. I'm glad you might be going home today. Fiona, hi, if I didn't say- I did say hello to you, I remember now, I did. Positively, I didn't do your shout-out. I knew there was somebody I was missing. And of course... Ooh, how do I... Let's try that. I might be spelled out more. My brain isn't working fully yet. You feel a bit better? You still need rest? Well, I'm glad you're doing better, Kayla. You'd think I had my my commands memorized by now. I don't. And yeah, you would suggest getting the Java edition because it runs a little better and you get access to custom mod packs. Cool. I don't know if I'll ever get it though, Ed Dog. I've got so many games I'm already not playing that I really love. But we'll see. We'll see. All right, I gotta look this up. Is it pause? <laughs> I'm driving myself nuts with this. <laughs> I'm doing well, thanks, Kayla. There we go. I knew I'd eventually hit on it. <laughs> yep, people don't want to leave South City. Got it. Oh, there goes my cough. Trying not to. Yeah, I've heard of John. He's a bloody legend. <laughs> You're lurking. Have things this morning. Can't wait to see how the island turns out. It's going to be a long wait. It's gonna be a long wait, you guys. I may give up and end up doing dev commands. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. Oh, and Captain with the gifted subs again. You are too generous. So Nancy, Joffrio, Glean, Sparky, Sims, and Maggie. And Captain, you are too kind and too generous. Thank you so much. Lots of love. I want to give lots of love and hearts to Aunt Captain for that. I wish I had animated emotes already. I don't know when that becomes a thing. I am. I want to do it vanilla. We'll see. I have to grab a cough drop. You're going to hear the rapper. Sorry. We'll see. We'll see how my patience holds out. Hi, Bean Drinker. Hello. I'm glad you caught a life too. Glad to see you. Mm, visiting site doesn't really matter. Maybe they could be my neighbor. I <laughs> could put the visiting site on their own little island because all of this is going to get moved. None of this will be staying. We'll just tuck them back here. Sure. This would be a lovely lovely spot to uh, camp. <laughs> this is going to eventually be uh, Linus's tent. That's that's the one thing I am very sure of. It has a demo, doesn't get full access. Yeah. Cool. Let's make this our uh, marker. 
I like that there's a doggo den. Maybe we'll get lucky and have a rare doggo spawn there. We need one. We need one doggo for um in in town. I'm trying to remember the name of the dog. I've never. I've only seen it on Stardew Valley Expanded mod. You're going on a coffee run? I'll take a nice tea. Because <laughs> I'm difficult like that. I wish I liked coffee. Isn't today's Fletch's birthday? Right, we will beat all the milestones. And tea, if you will, for Lorianne as well, please. And Jersey wants a coffee. Right, Bean Drinker? Stardew Valley is so nice. I was actually tempted to stream Stardew Valley soon again. And then a uh, Jersey and Girly Gamer inspired me with her Animal Crossing Island. So I thought, let's make a Stardew Valley Island. Yeah, I will find you some fruit. I might have a few on me. In the game you're going to create one day, we'll have a part where the player is cursed to be a mermaid or merman for a quest. Interesting. T for Angelie, too, please. <laughs> I remember being at the little, like, Starbucks kiosk at our grocery store once. I don't like Starbucks because I don't like coffee. And I just wanted an iced tea. It was really hot. They're like, we don't have it. I'm like, can I have a hot tea, please, and a cup of ice? I mean, it's like, not that hard to just come up with some iced tea. <laughs> Shelly wants it's just coffee, extra shot of espresso. I think we all just need some melatonin and a nap. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay, let's check out. We got a Harvest Master. Nice. Walking about. Poisoned. Okay, I did get the poisoned one even though I didn't have the journal yet. All right, look at that. We already have 50 points. Thanks, Fletch. I'll figure out something to do. I'll tell you what. Thank you, Fletch. I love that, Fletch. <laughs> Hey, my alerts finally woke up. We're gonna have a few come through now. Thank you again, Aunt Captain. Oh, you have a local business that has really good pastries. Angelie gonna make me some hot Milo to help me sleep. I'm not familiar with that, so I hope I said it right. Oh, thanks, Misty. Hi, Ellie Jelly, hello, how are you? I didn't mean to talk to you, Fletch. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm on it. We're gonna make a campfire. Get that going. I don't remember picking up a shell. So let's get rid of that. We'll go pop our sleeping bag in our tent. I can't bury any fruit or anything yet, but we can cook some bush limes. Actually, Oh, that's only health. Sometimes I do cook Kwandongs instead of the bush limes because they're a little bit more... No, they're more health. We're going to just stick with Phil tried and true bush lime for right now. It's a... Oh, a malt chocolate drink. Okay. Ellie, I thought of you yesterday because Tom was playing a little dinkum and every time he'd see meat lying on the ground, he'd pick it up and yell, free meat. It was really cute. I'm going to cook these and then we'll do a little bug catching. 
You try to go to a local business that has really good pastries. Their almond Danish is epic. The dough is made with lemon butter. That sounds really good. Moxie, you streamers have no idea what you all mean to me and my coping through rough moments. Aunt Captain, I, I, I'm I, glad we can provide a little comfort for you. I, I do know a little bit of what it's like going through rough moments, so I feel ya. I, I get you on that one. Hi, Blue Sky. Hope you're all doing good today. Bonus stream. It is a bonus stream. I just really wanted some dinkum today, and I thought we could all just use it on a Monday morning. Let me know if the music's too loud. I kind of had my speakers cranked up, so I just turned it down a little bit on my end, but... <laughs> we do all love you, Aunt Captain, and really, you provide so much to this community too i love it when i see you on ginger streams and reaps and just love when i get to hear you in voice chat you're always such a delight so fun to watch i love watching you bust ginger's chops so much fun hey do you all know if crepe myrtle trees are in australia because oh my god they come in so many colors okay good thanks misty I now have to look up a crepe myrtle tree. <laughs> I'm looking it up. <laughs> I've heard of like myrtle, but oh wow, those are really pretty. I'm trying to see if I can find a picture with a bunch of them together. But they're like pink and purple and... I'm trying to find like a really good example to pop up. Let me see if I've got the right tree. Is that it, Ellie Jelly? Like they come in several colors. That's a really pretty tree. You like that one? Those are nice. You have one in your front yard. It's like a magenta. Your neighbor's is red. Ooh, hi, Robert. Hello. That's the one. Those are really pretty. I'd love to see that in game. And look at me figuring out and remembering how to show pictures and things. <laughs> Learning to do the streamer things. That's a really pretty tree. Okay, we've got lots of bush lime for energy. Let's start getting some bugs and stuff. Can't wait to have a shovel to plant these. We're just gonna live our little dinkum life before we can start living that Stardew Valley Pelican Town life. I was going to say, so do we go to the JoJo route or the community center route? <laughs> Googled and found crepe myrtles. Uh, I'm not going to blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Words I can't say. Indica and its hybrids are flowering trees and shrubs widely grown in Australian gardens. Maybe James could include it. Those are really pretty. It'd be nice to have another colorful tree in the game. Maybe something that's, if not year round, at least on a different season. <laughs> Jojo, money is kind. Dinks for me. <laughs> Community center says Angelique. Brand new island for Pelican Town. Got it. Yeah. I would have reused my Bodega Bay one that I just started because I realized my Bodega Bay idea, I like it, but some of it wouldn't be that much different than my Arwick Island, so it's kind of redundant and not necessarily needed. And then I got really inspired by Girly Gamer and Jersey Games. Thanks, Jersey. So now I have to do this. I really like this island shape, though. I almost hate to destroy it. It's really cool. Like, I was able to run almost the entire outskirt without having to swim. 
Right, I didn't have to swim very much. am bummed I'll miss this in the amazing community vibe oh and captain thank you so much we love you and I hope you can get some sleep and hope you're feeling better you take care of yourself hopefully latte is providing some comfort and love for you it looks like an octopus it kind of yeah <laughs> There's definitely a tentacly vibe about it, isn't there? It's interesting. Just saw a butterfly and then got distracted. There it is. Yeah, the fun part is trying to figure out which buildings to use for the buildings in Pelican Town and like which I might have to dirt print and all of that. Should probably save a couple of these flies. Thanks, Jersey. It is a fun map. You're looking for YouTubers' favorite gemstones for your own game? I don't have a favorite, really. My birthstone is opal. So that's why it's kind of fun when I find them in-game. Well, at least I've done all my daily chat tasks. I wouldn't mind finding a few more bugs before calling it a day. Hey, we got a little tin nice close by. Citrine's your favorite? Pretty. Which girl isn't a lover of diamonds? I mean, of course I love diamonds. I was just trying to think of something else pretty and unique and fun. Uh, dinner's in the oven. What's in the- what are you cooking tonight, chocolate latte? What's on the menu? Poor Tom had some dental work done Thursday, so he hasn't been on solid foods yet, really. I was able to cook him some scrambled eggs the other day. He ate those. It's mostly been like little concoctions with very finely ground sausage or beef and rice and mashed potatoes. <laughs> Tonight we'll have ravioli because that's nice and soft and you can cut them up small. I just want to maybe get a few more buggy bugs. Finally caught alive. Hi, Nini. Watching this makes you want to start another island. Do it. <laughs> Amethyst is beautiful. I also like Lapis. Lapis is pretty. I'm not a huge lover of turquoise, but my Nan had some lovely turquoise jewelry. She lived in New Mexico for a very long time and had some lovely pieces. I have one of them now. I wish we could get a fishing pole on day one. Have I seen Australian opals? Are they much different than, um... Like the kind of opals we see out here. And <laughs> Tommy he threw a straw. It's not that bad. He he was on kind of a yogurt protein drink kind of diet for a few days. You're not a fan of diamonds? They're too mainstream, right? Opals though, gosh, so unique and pretty. I think that's why I like having them as my birthstone because you don't see them a lot. Your birthstone's aquamarine. Aquamarine is lovely as well. Tonight's... Oh, macaroni and cheese. I might make that later in the week. Minted peas and fresh crusty bread. That sounds all delicious. You've made that sound posh enough for a basic meal. Hey, some of the most simple things... Well, one, macaroni and cheese isn't always that simple to make. It's a lot of steps and a lot of mess. 
But such a lovely comfort food. So delicious. <laughs> Super deluxe. Sounds like a good meal to me. I've never had minted peas. I love peas, though. I don't think I've caught one of you yet. Oh, we're tired. I think we're gonna just go turn in early, get started on our next day, get John here. I want to talk. I don't think if if I talk to Fletch, I don't think I have the option to do a favor for her yet. Like, I'd love to wish her a happy birthday, but we just can't. I'll take your diamonds. <laughs> oh, that's you're a fellow Opal birthstone person, too. Nice. <laughs> you love mushy peas? They sell mint and mushy peas in Great Yarmouth and Norwich. I would probably like them. Keep waiting for this cough syrup I took to kick in, and it is not. So I keep muting the microphone. Hopefully I won't uh, forget to unmute it. <laughs> Hi, Fletch. We have? I will? Okay. Okay. Nope. Can't offer to do anything for her. Let's go put some of these bugs down by the visitor center's tent, just so I'll have them for the museum. Your peas aren't mushy, just whole and frozen? <coughs> Excuse me. Pea fritter sounds good. I mean, anything fritter <laughs> would sound good to me. Apple fritter, corn fritter, pea fritter. I'm trying to think of what other fritters there are out there. Oi. <laughs> Catch it. Good job. Alrighty, we're going to just turn in early. Sweet potato fritters. You have these stands like burger vans, but they sell mushy peas and pies. So British. Love it. Pineapple fritter? I haven't had that, but I love pineapple. Each YouTuber will get an item with their gem of choice. If they're beta testers, that's a cool idea. <coughs> Woo. I am struggling to talk all of, a side, all of a sudden. I don't know why. It's getting a little frustrating. So you guys are just going to have to deal with it. <laughs> I'll go talk to Fletch first. See if she gives me money to get the saw. I want to try a uh, pineapple fritter now. That sounds really good. I did see that. Okay, cool. I've got 900 points to spend. I do know a point about the licenses. Okay. It'd be nice if uh, she would skip the dialogue if you actually picked. She do know about it. Okay. Okay. We'll spend our points. Let's let's go, Fletch. Okay. 
We're gonna get mining. You get lychee and ice cream. Uh, lychee. I always say that wrong the first time around. Lychee and ice cream for dessert from the Chinese restaurants. Interest. I've never had that. Uh, let's get logging. I want to get a shovel too. I'd like to be able to fish as well, but... 250 for that. How much is... Oh, 500 for excavation. Blech. Let's try and earn that, because I'd like to get these coconuts planted. But I, if not, I'll go ahead and get the fishing pole license. Uh-oh, the next you'll say will probably cause an argument. Sorry in advance. Uh-oh, here we go. <laughs> let's see what this will be. Um, let's just stuff some of this in here for right now. Sell our bugs, see if we can afford the saw. Wait, <laughs> I always do that. <laughs> oh, banana fritter and pineapple fritters. And the lychee ice cream are staples in every Chinese restaurant. Not here, but it sounds good. Oh, lychee, I said it right the first time. I've heard it both ways. I think I've heard people, because isn't that also like a type of um, <sighs> martini? I don't mind. Oh, Ed Dog, I'm with you. I don't mind pineapple on pizza either. We actually did a poll on this a while back. Most people do not like it. I'm fine with it on the right kind of pizza. So I said it right, and then I said it wrong, and now I'm only going to say it the wrong way. <laughs> yeah, we did do a pull blue sky, and no to pineapple on pizza one. Sounds like lychee, lychee. <laughs> Fiona's with you, Ed Dog. I like it with ham. I don't like it with sausage. I've never tried it with pineapple. But yeah, I, I stopped dating a guy because that's how he liked it. No, that's not the reason I stopped dating him. But yeah, he ordered it sausage and pineapple. I did not like that combination at all. Uh, I can have, I, I should be able to do that today. We're going to learn to do the furnace today, I think. Let's see, 5200. Oh, did I not sell my stuff? No. I hope no Italians in chat. <laughs> it is a hot topic, I'll tell you. It gets it gets people riled up. They have strong opinions. Maybe ban polls. Those peeps voted for Story of Seasons over Roots of Pacha. Right, Blue Sky? I might do a Pacha stream this week, too. We'll see. If my cough, though, doesn't get better than what it is right now, I'm not going to be able to. Because the amount of times I've had to mute the microphone right now are a little bit silly. We'll see. Usually July is a good month for me as far as my cough. Hi, Iris. Hello. You're hungry? Oh, no, Fiona. It's going to be a long... A long, a long stream if you're hungry. Um, let's see how much for that. We do need the pickaxe right now so we can get uh, Fletch's quest done. I'm gonna have to go find a lot of tin for John. You like pineapple on pizza, especially on Hawaiian? Yeah, I've almost tried round tables Hawaiian style, but I haven't yet. To me, it has to be pineapple and ham only, maybe some bacon. I agree with you. Yeah, Round Table has like a Maui Zowie sauce or whatever it's called. I've not tried it. I will, but he wants tin bars, Fletch, so can we get started on the furnace? They serve it in pizza places in Rome, but I guess it's because people ask for it. 
I wasn't reading. I was I was reading chat. Okay, cool. Yep, I'm ready. Let's go. Okay. I got it. Let's go find that tin. I'm going to put the table saw. Oh, there's some right here. Handy. I forget what part of the Stardew Valley game this music's used in, but it's like making me nervous. Like, I'm on the clock. <laughs> I'm just gonna stick you right there for now. Nothing too fancy. I guess we could head towards some deserty type areas. Let's head out this way looking for ore. <laughs> Boozy Loomer's coming back with everybody's order. There's a coffee for Jersey. Is that a hot tea for Lorianne? <laughs> Blue Sky's got some martinis for Boozy. <laughs> Blue Sky, you got my number. That's cute. <laughs> yeah, I have allergies, Kayla. I don't know why they're kicking up right now. Ah, here we go. So it's just annoying because I just get a stuffy nose. I don't get itchy eyes. I don't get a runny nose. I don't get any of the normal things. I just get stuffy and I get a cough. I just have this constant little tickle in my throat. I feel great otherwise. Nothing wrong with me. So it's a little frustrating. Well, there's some more. You knew one would not be sufficient. That's hilarious. I think we only need f five to make it, so I need to get extra though. I think we have enough to smelt the two bars for John. I think it was just the two, is that what he wanted? Yeah, we should have enough. Let's get a little more though. Don't eat it. <laughs> Boozy is the best. Coffee runs, fun dinkum videos. You were sneezing all day. I've been sneezing a little bit too. It's just that time of year, I guess. Plus, you know, like, I'm not sure where you are, but where I am, we're in California. And after years of drought, we had a really wet winter. So, so many things are just blooming right now. Ooh, yeah, 24 tin ore already. This is the winter music, I think. I love the winter music. Making, oh, you're making chocolate latte. Yearned to go back to Rome. Stayed in a wonderful place years ago. Run by a family who cooked your meals. It was amazing. That sounds amazing. I would go too. The, let's see, Blue Sky says the architecture was stunning and the food even better. I would love to go to Rome. I would love to travel all over Europe. Um, I gotta do the thing first. Did you know pizza wasn't originally called pizza? It was a complete random event. Interesting. Hi, Fletch. Nope, nope, nope. That's a box. That's not Fletch. That's Fletch. 
Reeps, if you're still there, Tom was playing this weekend and I walked in the room and saw him running around with his character. He's still wearing the little cape. It was adorable. He's running all over his island with his little, little cape you gave him just flowing behind him. <laughs> Made me so happy. Right now, we're just going to stick it here like this. We'll figure out a cute way to arrange things. And your chook, Reaps was here, is still doing very well. I did play on that island a little bit. Oh, this is going to be slow. You've had the same kind of cough for years. Nothing really seems to help. I know, Nini. This started like when I was in high school and it did used to just only be seasonally like in the spring and now it's just year round. I've given up on trying to figure out. Nasa Court seems to be helping me the most. Sometimes switching it up to a little Zyrtec. Claritin D used to work great, but it, it elevates my blood pressure. I can't take that anymore. Reeps does need to go to bed. You only have seven hours. We need you uh, bright and fresh and alert for your stream, Reeps. And I hate to bring up the subject, but I'm curious, Reeps, how's the house hunting going? I feel so out of touch because I haven't caught like the last two streams. Oh, it was called bread with tomato and cheese. Not very snappy. You've had five hours already. You fell asleep on the couch. Oh no, you need really good deep sleep. It started out as flatbread with sauce, cheese, and a few toppings, but it was cheap. One day the Queen of Italy was going through and was enthralled by the smell of it. I do remember hearing a story similar to that about it. No house yet? Oh no. I know you'll find one. Hey, we've got John's bars. We got one cooking for Fletch. Although I think we keep it, the one that we do for Fletch. <laughs> and that's how pizza came to be. I love pizza. Too bad Missy isn't here right now. She loves pizza. <laughs> what you doing there, Moxie? <laughs> it's nice and warm and toasty. I don't have an axe yet. Really wanted to get another license, but eh. let's go to give John his two bars. See what that gives us. I look at how cute the little fish sign in a uh, little toy box look in here. Yep. A coffee table, fancy. Ooh, we can go get the um, digging excavation one or whatever. Try and get it before they both close so I can go buy a shovel. We'll get fishing tomorrow. I'll tell you what, I appreciate that, Fletch. Thank you. There's gonna be a volcano area in your game? <gasps> See, if we did Ginger Island here, we could have a volcano. Speck has been doing a volcano on her pirate island. It's looking pretty cute. 
Yeah, let me go spend some more dink. Although I don't have a whole lot to spend. We're going to have to... Ooh. I usually am much more organized about this with how I uh, get John in, usually on his first visit, but... I don't know that I've spent enough yet. I'm a little low on dinks. I should have caught more bugs before going to bed. That must be what I did differently. I rushed it. And how much is fishing? 250. Yeah, we're gonna have to wait. I'll sell maybe some. Nah. I wanna hold on to everything else I have. Those won't sell for anything. That wasn't worth picking up. And that's my tent. Pirate Island? That sounds amazing. You just know they have rum. Hi, Bethany. Hello. <laughs> I like how Boozy thinks. You can have this one meat and this one poop. You can have those, too. Thank you. I just want to be able to buy a shovel. I should get an axe first, but I want to plant my coconuts. I think we can do both. I think I was wrong, because I thought it said it was 500, not 900. Never mind. That's fine. <laughs> so tomorrow we can get our fishing pole, our fishing license. All right, let's grab those coconuts. Lovely. <laughs> she turns an island into a mermaid. Yes, the mermaid is stunning. Looks so good. Maybe we'll run around. We'll catch a few more bugs to sell tomorrow. We'll plant our coconuts and we'll catch a few bugs to sell too. Hi, Nancy. Hope you're doing well today. Um, let's just kind of plant the coconuts back by the visitor's tent for now. Not too close together. I'm gonna do one in the water. No, <laughs> thought I missed it. Go in alert mode and try and sleep. All right, Angelie, I hope you sleep very well. We'll keep it down. <laughs> Thank you for popping in and joining us. You have a good night. Yeah, I think Spec might have gone off to bed, but she has been working on a mermaid. It's a, actually a pirate. Pirate Island. There's a beautiful mermaid on the map. She's working on a compass. I forget what else. Um, there's a lot of shenanigans afoot. <laughs> a lot of walking the plank. It's very fun. If you guys are able to, you do need to check out Specs. Streams of that. <laughs> Where have you been? I I'm telling Boozy, you'll find now that you're doing your own videos and stuff, it's so hard to stay caught up. I just catch what I can when I can. Sometimes I can't. I have to watch things in just bits and pieces. Jersey! Is Jersey popping out or just saying goodnight? To oh, Angeli. I'm sorry. He's saying goodnight to you. I was confused. <laughs> Easy to do with me. Um, I was going to head that way and then just never finished.
Ooh, dragonfly. I'll talk to John again when we get back. I don't think I've spent enough money for him to want to move in, but we'll see. I think we might have to do, do one more day. Nyeh, let's not go that way. Why am I feeling like I should start a new save? This happens every time I watch someone with a new state save too. There's just something so fun and relaxing about the early days of Dinkum. It's just Dinkum. Just you and your bug net and your pickaxe trying to make it through the day without things killing you. You're a little tired, but hope the tiredness goes away. You probably, you know, your body's still healing, Kayla. You probably just still need to get some rest. You'll be feeling better sooner than you realize. Just need some more sleepies. We're just going to use this pickaxe up. I'd like to make another furnace. Oh, let's see. Oh, cook something at the cooking table. Ha ha ha. Like, actually, I might be able to make a cooking table. I do have stuff for fruit salad. I was going to laugh like, oh, joke's on me. I can't even do that yet, but I might be able to. We'll go see. I probably need some palm wood though, and I didn't buy an axe, so never mind. I won't be able to. Derp. <laughs> a new island is always so fun. It's just all the possibilities. It's addicting, right, Misty? You're right. <laughs> Ellie Jilly, I always say yes when someone says, I sh should I do a new island? Yes. It's kind of like when you play an, <clears throat> excuse me, an MMO, or at least for me, like in World of Warcraft, I have so many alt characters I play, and I feel like games like this and Stardew Valley, instead of alt characters, I just have alt islands. Don't think I had a funnel web yet. I want this copper, but I'm gonna avoid it for now. I just want tin. Altaholic? Yeah, it's I'm an islandaholic or something. I'm this bad in Stardew. It's just so peaceful, too. No villagers asking for favors. Tamika, both beef sandwich, vanilla ice cream? Sounds good to me. Yes to it all. I wish I could get the big jiggly rocks. Ooh, I didn't bring much food with me, did I? Oopsies. There simply aren't enough hours in your day, <laughs> Boozy. Boozy speaks the truth. I'd have more hours if I were willing to give up sleep, and I'm just not willing to give that up anymore. I used to. Back in my early days of gaming, when I was still young, in my 30s. <laughs> Oops, missed some. I'd stay up till 2 or 3 a.m. playing World of... Or Ashron's Call 2, and then the same with World of Warcraft. Loved it. I was very addicted. 
Now I get tired. Sleep wins out. I love Ellie Jelly's videos, too. They're so good. I also love watching Ellie on commit streams. What did you say on the one the other night? I don't know. I can't remember what he was saying. Oh! What did you call him? It was hilarious. Like Dr. Frilly or something? I cracked up. I was just sitting here and I, I laughed pretty hard at that one, Ellie. It was cute. It was fun watching Mr. Saturday on the stream with you guys. Up till 2 or 3 a.m. with the gang and then at work at 6 a.m. Oi. <laughs> yeah, fortunately back then when I was working, it was a part time job, so I didn't have to be at work a little bit later in the day, but it was still rough. I remember looking for a job around that time, too, and it's like <laughs> filling out my resume. It's like, can I put that I'm a guild leader on here? I mean, it shows I have leadership skills. <laughs> Everybody told me no, so I didn't. Aw, oh, thanks, Blue Sky. Yeah, when Ellie asked what he was doing and he immediately, yes, he acted like he was in trouble. That was so funny. All right, we're tired, we're out of, do we, do we have any like uncooked food? We do. We'll just eat, a, eat some nanners to get us home. So funny. Yeah, Iris, I, I didn't, I wasn't able to afford an axe today because I went to bed too early yesterday. Normally I spend that first night till the wee hours catching bugs and I didn't do it for some reason this time. So we'll get an axe tomorrow and go get some palm wood. So I won't be able to do all my chores. Don't tell Shannon. <laughs> Mind my axe. Yeah, it's not going to last much longer. How are you missing all these streams? You promised to do better. I know. <laughs> It's just so hard to keep up. There's so many great Dinkum and other game also streamers out right now. Oops, I meant to do a whole thing and didn't do it. What else do I need for that? Oh, I need two more stone for that. That's right. Let's see if I can get two stone. I don't know if I can. Hi, shark. Ah, Reeves, good night. You sleep well, my friend. Okay, lady, I love you. Bye bye. We will see you later. That one I need to put down, and that one. I commit. Hello. We said his name, and he appeared. <laughs> Hope you're doing well today. We we're just talking about how fun it was to watch uh, you and Ellie on your stream the other night with Mr. Saturday. I enjoyed it very much. I love that his character is my dude. 
<laughs> Hi, John. So hopefully tomorrow he'll want to move in. I didn't do a good job today. What's new, John? Time is an illusion. Lunchtime doubly so. Oh. Um, actually, no. Catch ya. He'll probably want to move in tomorrow. Let's maybe finish smelting a couple bars, or we'll pop these in and go to bed. Well, being an Air Force veteran who used to work on a, the flight line, yep. <laughs> We got skills. You walked downstairs and heard your name. Glad you all had fun. Yeah, I love how he's my dude. So then I think I started that sentence and didn't finish it. So that way all the NPCs are all chill calling him my dude. So now I should have made a character called Sweet Cheeks. Cause I want them all to call me Sweet Cheeks. <laughs> Um, yeah, we've got some things to sell at the store. So we'll do that. Oh, he's not open yet. <clears throat> Let's see about getting our fishing license, too, so we can start getting some fish to sell. Cook some food. I will, Iris. I will be doing that. I've got to go harvest bush limes. <clears throat> Excuse me, berry three fruit, and we will chat. We'll chat with you right away. Hi, gamer mom. Hello. Hope you're doing well. We've been talking food. <laughs> like usual. Oh, that's right. He is open earlier when he's still in the visitor's tent. But I want to get my uh, fishing license first. Well, let's get metal detecting now, too. Yeah, the cough is annoying, huh, Kayla? I might sell some of my waddle too, except it's in this tent. I don't know why I keep running to my tent like I've got storage in there. <laughs> I have a sleeping bag and a table. That is it. Yeah, we don't need all of those right now. We'll get a lot of those. Just gonna plant one of each tree for right now for our our points just because I don't know where where we're gonna put an orchard yet we just need a little small base of operations grilled cheese sounds delicious What's new, John? Yeah, you sell them back in South City as pets. That's awesome. Just keep buying them, bud. About to eat now. Maybe catch the end of the stream later. Enjoy your dinner chocolate latte. Some mac and cheese sounds delicious. Sounds good. And let me buy some things and then we'll ask what favor we can do for him. Creepy dink. <laughs> Entrepreneur. Yay, he's ready to move in. We'll go get the deed. 
for the, uh, we'll pay, we'll get the deed for the, uh, bulletin board, pay that off, and then grab his shop deed. Boy. We're gonna have to sell a few more things to, do, to pay off both deeds. No, we only have to pay off the one, that's right. We'll just be a little bit short, but let me catch a few fish. Sell them. Still want to do a favor for him. Yeah. <laughs> What's with taking all my tin bars, John? Don't you know how hard they are to get at this level? My goodness. Taking all my stuff. Alright. I mean, he didn't say you beauty, so I appreciate it. Sand shoes! We got shoes! <laughs> Not the color I would have picked with this outfit, but that's alright. We can't be too, too picky here. Let's see, how much do I have? Oh, I've got enough to do uh, both deeds. Let's, let's grab those before Fletch... Oh, it's still early morning. <laughs> I was thinking it was later in the day. I love it to commit. I still don't know how we're going to make a Stardew Valley Pelican Town out of this, but we're going to do our, our darndest. Hey Fletch, I'm here to do the things. Channel will be proud of me. I'm doing the bulletin board first, paying that off. And then we'll get the other. It does sound like a music box. Should I skip ahead on the album? Some of this music I don't really recognize. I don't hate it, though. <laughs> I'm usually done cleaning the house by now, so I don't hear the whole album. <laughs> So the bulletin board we'll have to put up like in front of the store to kind of imitate the little quest board in uh, Stardew Valley that's on Pierre's store. Seventy-five thousand dinks at this. This start of the game seems like a lot. Oh, I didn't buy the metal detector won't be for sale, that's right, until he sets up his permanent shop. That's fine. We'll have to go get palm wood and stuff for the shop. So that'll keep us busy today. We'll cook some food so we have it to eat. I don't recognize this music either from the game. I'm going to put the shop just right next to it. Right next to Fletch. Not even a space. No. <laughs> I'm in the way. I'll probably move it anyway. That's just to get us started. So I think we're going to need nails... Palm wood, gum wood, sheets, tin sheets. Yeah, so we gotta go find some palm wood and cut it down. All right, I gotta play with this music. I'm going back to the start of the album because we're now in weird, like not weird, but different. Oh, that's just Elliot's theme. I forget everybody has their own theme. No, that's not Elliot's theme. Oh, Sam's band, this is Sam's band. Interesting. Let's just go back to the start. <laughs> okay. Whew. Let's bury the three fruit. 
If you could have a theme song from any game you've played, what would it be? Let me put on this. I, I'm trying to think. I, I haven't played a lot of different variety of games, that's the thing. I mean, this right here <laughs> makes me feel so at ease and peace when I first log into the game. But I love summer. This is my jam. <laughs> No, this wouldn't be my theme either. Sorry, we're going back. <laughs> I have to think of that. That's a good question, Commit. There's some music in World of Warcraft I really love too. I'd have to really think about that one. What are some answers you guys have? That's a tough one for me. And we gotta harvest bush limes. We'll do that while we go get some palm trees. Let's just head here first. Let me uh, cook. Yeah, we'll just cook these. That's fine. This might be it, actually. This could be it. Hi, Sherry. Hello. I don't have a Dinkum playlist. I probably should. Where you get these songs from? I am using Spotify and uh, I purchased the Stardew Valley album. Well, actually, no, I purchased that through Amazon. I'm listening to the Stardew Valley album on Spotify. We're gonna probably wish we had more food, but I don't- I'm feeling just lazy. <laughs> Which game's that, Blue Sky? La Cremosa of Dana, or Dana. The music is just brilliant. I would have a song in that game. Like, I'm trying to think if there's any music, like, from certain fights in games I've played, or... But this, when I first put on this in Stardew Valley, I just feel so peaceful. Take a deep sigh and just know everything's gonna be fine. I'm gonna rebury the seeds here. Since this wasn't too far from where we live, it's just easier. That's not where you were. I do love the, the music in Dinkum a lot. There's that one song, I don't know the name of it, it plays in the winter mornings. Love it. Yes, you can choose Xanadu as your favorite playlist. Hey Vince, hello, how are you? Hope you're doing well. I saw Xanadu play when it first came out on VHS. <laughs> I don't think we saw it in the theater. I'm old enough to have seen it in the theater. I remember loving it as a kid. Might feel a little differently now, I don't know, but I remember I loved, I think I had that with the record as well. I loved the music at the time. You're waiting for it to go back on Broadway? Nice. No, Vince, this isn't. This is a special island. I was really inspired by a video uh, tour that Jersey Games did of Girly Gamers Island. She did an Animal Crossing Island. And so I want to try and do a Stardew Valley Island. 
So it's kind of special <laughs> for that. So for right now, we're just trying to get it up and running and nothing is permanent that I'm doing in the game right now. It's all going to be changing up. Dog Shep would probably just come and dig a thousand holes if it were open. <laughs> you could play that song on your Fisher Price record player. All right, I didn't have a Fisher Price record player. I had something a little bit nicer than that, but it was a portable record player my parents gave me. It looked like a little mini leather briefcase. It was hilarious. I wish I had a picture of it. I used to get so annoyed. Oh, we got an engine. Because my sister would borrow my albums, like she took my Grease album and played it, and then left it sitting in the sun so it got warped. That was the worst. I never got another copy of it. I love listening to Grease. <laughs> trying to remember what grade I was in. Probably third or fourth grade. Let's get one more tree. You had an Aristocat portable record player? Nice. Rookie moves, sis. <laughs> Look at me being good and replanting trees, though. I'm learning from you guys. I'll do the same with the bottle brush. You had a Sony Walkman to listen to Thriller. I had a Walkman too. Bye, Croco. Oh, we need to pick a, for a few more bush lime too. Your theme song would have to be Franklin's theme song. I'll have to, next time I have the in-game music on, uh, listen to it. I like the music um, in Irwin's Barn. It's very sweet. I do not like the town hall music. That's my least favorite music. It's kind of like spooky doll. Somebody said it that way and I agree. It's like a spooky doll music. Hi Fletch. Okay, we're gonna saw logs. Eventually make a box. Do some things. Hopefully get John's shop going. Oh wait, we're gonna need more tin too. I think. I think it takes wait, we might have enough. Is it two sheets and 16 nails? Yeah, we have just enough, but I'm going to need more for a storage box. Hey, Shannon, how are you doing? Hope you had a good weekend. I need a workbench. I should have just done the nails while I was there. Oh, well. Misty, you were in the sixth grade when Grease came out. My best friend and I snuck into the theater and stayed for five showings. Oh my gosh, her mom was so mad. That's hilarious and I love it. Oh, The Sims 3 soundtrack for Tamika. Love it. What about... Wait, I have to scroll back up. I missed it. From Blue Sky. What about China in Your Hand from Tapau? I'm not familiar with that. Is Chaos Island coming back? I, I really don't know, Vince. I just, I was really inspired to do this one. So I kind of, I'm, I'm going to be a little selfish and kind of just focus on this for a little bit, I think. Nini, at the very least, you're probably the oldest Steph here. I am also a Steph in real life. I'm older. Don't know if I'm the oldest. <laughs> I like to wear my age as like a just a badge of honor and pride though, really. 
Because I love, back when I started, I didn't get into gaming till I was in my early 30s. And um, it was already at the time people were like, girl gamers, they, girls don't play games. And then I've met so many amazing women who play games, and I love that we all are still playing them to this day. Let's see, I need a few more of those and like one more of that. Do a few more. I do want to still do Chaos Island events. The thing with Chaos, though, is like in the name, it's Chaos, because I want that to be one where people just don't know when I'm going to be playing from there. I might not even post the stream in our Discord because I want to list it public. Of course, you are always welcome because I know you've been putting in a lot of work and effort on that. So I'll, I can let you know ahead of time. But I just want that random, like, you never know who's going to show up and be there that day vibe to it. But I don't want it to be like a regular weekly thing. I hope that makes sense a little bit because that's like all part of the chaos. For curiosity's sake, yeah. Oh, this just takes palm wood. Palm wood nails. So we might go run around and try and get some more tin if we can. That was a back in my day. Yes, back in my day, we had to play our games on dial-up. Okay, just double checking. So day after tomorrow, we'll have that. <clears throat> Let's click these Kwandongs and go on a hunt for more tin. Might be closer to a two hour stream today than three hour because that muscle I pulled Saturday is just starting to get really cranky with me. <laughs> Tom's like, how did you hurt your back? I'm like, I don't know. I was sitting down and then I stood up and then it hurt. Because <laughs> I'm talented. Back in my day, I used to have to wait for three sunders to start attacking. Okay, Grandpa. Dog Chef, I remember the three sunder days. My, my my hunter knew to wait. I knew I got very good at waiting for you to get your aggro. <laughs> I forgot about that. I know some people prefer the banana or the quandong. I'm, I'm a simple girl. I still like the simple bush lime. The first, like, real computer game I ever played was the original Sims. And it was shortly after Tom and I got married and we were living in our first house and his computer died. So we only had one computer. So we would take turns playing it. And whoever wasn't playing, we would just sit next to the other person in, like, backseat game. <laughs> Those were very fun days, though. All right, let's go find some tin. We'll like, uh, eh, we'll cut through here up to there. See you later, Vince, you take care. Glad we could just say hi at least. We'll talk to you soon. I should keep an eye out for doggos, too. I'm always so hopeful, and I'm already going the wrong way because I saw some logs. So at least that saves energy not having to cut them. This 
is kind of interesting out here, this little sandbar. That's neat. This is a really neat island. <laughs> Which will soon be destroyed. Get a little copper. Back in your day, we had rectangular controllers with cables. <laughs> Blowing on cartridges was considered troubleshooting. I remember those days. My very first, like, console was an Atari... Was it 5200? Was that the number? And it wasn't even mine originally. My grandma bought it for herself. Because she played it at my cousin's house and had so much fun with it. She bought it for herself. And then it made her too nervous. So she gave it to me and my sister. <laughs> I had some sort of jungle game. Pac-Man. And I don't remember what else. Hi, Croft. Ignore me. <laughs> Go, Grandma. <laughs> ZX Spectrum, cassette tapes, lots of beeping and squealing, hoping and praying it wouldn't crash, but actually load. Do you know you're technically not supposed to blow in cartridges? I mean, obviously the manufacturer was wrong, but... <laughs> We're going to need a little of you at some point. Whew. I was afraid I was going to hit it with my axe and it was going to be really angry. I guess I should have sold my pickaxe before it broke. I sometimes try to remember to do that. Get a little dink for it. But then I wouldn't have gotten that. Oh, yeah. Your first console was an Atari. We played Pong. I didn't have Pong for my Atari. My next door neighbors used to have like the original like Pong machine or whatever device Pong was originally out on. You played Frogger. Cause didn't Pong come out originally like on its own thing or was it always like an Atari? I don't really know, it was so long ago. And then I still have a couple of handheld Nintendo games my grandma brought back from Japan in like the early 80s. I forget what they're called. I think I posted a picture in our Discord a long time ago. Still have those, but they haven't had batteries for years, so I, so I don't know if they still work. These fancy Vidya games in their blue teeth and more buttons than my clicker. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Yeah, Frogger and Donkey Kong. I never played- I have never played Donkey Kong, you guys. Played Frogger. Let's get a little more rock. Free me! I think I was over this area already. My friend had an Atari. You're sure they had Spider-Man and E.T. preferred Spider-Man games? <laughs> Oi. Okay, let's just wait for some meat. Thank you, doggo. Do you want to eat that? Good doggo. I wasn't going to take your, your reward. love that that's become a thing. I think it's something we all kind of collectively just started doing and then realized that everybody else also hollers it. <laughs> I just love that now Tom is hollering it as well. It was it was really rough this weekend trying to play it cool when I saw him logging into play. It's like, oh cool, yeah, what ifs? Hope you you have fun. He didn't like my answer, though. 
He said, um, he was asking, he made a rowboat. He's like, where do I put the rowboat? <laughs> In the water? <laughs> he thought maybe it worked like the hang glider and you keep it on your toolbar. <laughs> In the water. What's that, Shannon? Wait now? <laughs> oh, I get to play Spider-Man with ray tracing and 60 FPS. My how times have changed. <laughs> what now what, Shannon? <laughs> Is that English? Oh, geek speak. That's my hub's love language. That's cute. I need the grinder. Just the littlest bit, Shannon. He's on vacation. Well, he took a, this whole week off work because he had a big dental procedure Thursday. He wasn't sure how long of recovery he would need. So he may be off the rest of the week. But yeah, he played like two or three times over the weekend for a little bit. I'm not going to get my hopes up too much, but he's playing. <laughs> Back in your day, ray tracing was just old Raymond <laughs> tracing them pictures with his number two <laughs> Ty Ticonderoga in his spiral notebook, hoping he doesn't get caught. Oh my goodness. Ambient occlusion. Oh yeah, love that stuff. Shannon's fluent in geek speak. Dog Shep is as well. I'm not. I'm a thingamaboober and whatchamacallit kind of gal. I didn't even do any fishing yet. I don't know if I can even see any fish right now at this time of night. But we can try and get a couple. I thought I just saw one there. Yeah, I thought I saw a big boy. Root, he is a very rude stingray. Wants him. Hey, Chinooki! How are you doing, Chucky? Congratulations again on your uh, celebratory 1,000 subscriber stream the other day. I was only able to lurk for a little bit. I couldn't pop into chat and say hi or anything, but it looks like you were having such a great time. Thanks, Shannon, for doing that. Oh, actually, I think I changed it um, to the full name for Januki. Hi, jo Joffrey or Joff, Joff, Joff. Oh no, I'm gonna butcher your name. Can I just call you Joff? I'm so sorry. I'm having a words are hard day to day. Battle faster, you hear banjos. I know. <laughs> you can't stay long, but you want to drop a like and some love. You are amazing, Januki. Much love to you. You're only here for a short time. You have to go to work right away, but I wanted to say a quick thank you for the gift and membership. Oh, yes, Aunt Captain gave out memberships today. So thank you, Aunt Captain. She's already hopefully sound asleep right now, which is what our character is going to go do. We caught one fish. <laughs> I think. <laughs> I think we caught it. I don't even know. I'm having a Monday. <laughs> we did. Lovely. I think we're just going to play through one more day because I'm having to mute my microphone a ridiculous amount of times. We're on our second playthrough of the Stardew Valley album. John, you will have your store tomorrow. I'm not going to sell you that. We're going to put that down for the museum.
Let's go see if there are any quests on the board we can do. That's why I've been trying not to harvest all of the yellow wattle. I hopefully I've left enough around. Sell for fruit we can do. Chat with two residents we can do. We'll sell our bananas. Or actually we'll sell these. Keep the bananas. Belly jelly photo? Oh, I wasn't looking. I'm like, what? <laughs> Commit, it's really sad how long my little brain was trying to process. I didn't even pay attention to the picture. I was looking at something on my desk. <laughs> I'm so dumb. <laughs> You might actually get some work done when you finish. I cannot watch. I don't want to miss anything. You're so sweet, Boozy. Yeah, we'll make it a short one today so you, you all can get back to work. <laughs> I feel like we're going to need another axe and pickaxe soon. I kind of just want to do some fishing more than anything, but let's... Oh, yeah, let's talk to John. No, 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 not sell. Just talk. Yes. I want to do some fishing. We'll get the waddle later. Buy low, sell high. Yep. <laughs> it's alright, John. Your secret's safe. Fishing's good, because I can't talk. I have to concentrate, so that means I won't talk, uh, cough. <laughs> Some fish and chips would go down nice right about now, though. <laughs> well, this fish is rude. You would love to be active more often, but you have so little time right now, and so I'm often only in the lurk, but I miss it here actively to chat. You know, don't ever apologize or feel bad for that. We're just happy you can pop in and say hi now. I love the lurkers. I quite often am a lurker. Ooh, I didn't know I had tin right over there. I am also a lurker a lot of the times, because, you know, real life and other stuff going on. But it is fun when you can pop in and say hi to people. But no. Hello to all the lurkers. You're amazing. Let's put one of you down. Let's see what we have over here. <laughs> we have me not catching anything. That is very sweet. I... You know, I need to get my alert command going again. I was trying to do it. Stream Elements was fighting me on it. Because I was trying to do it to where it would say the person's name. And for some reason it would never work every time I set it up. And I was following a little step-by-step -step instructions. So thank you, Commit, for reminding me. I need to do that. Let me, after I catch this fish, I gotta write myself a note. Lurk. I have a little lurk emote, but it's not the same as the little, like, command. Hey, Shelly Marie, thank you for being a member for two months. Yeah, I have the little lurk emote. It's cute. But I know, I want to get the, uh... The actual chat, the command for it to work. So that'll be my project this afternoon.
I have some other things I might try too besides what I've been doing with stream elements. I want to have some fun with things. Ozzy Nuts has been very inspirational in that. His streams are so fun to watch. Can't tell if that's a fish out there. Hi, man, this is my favorite starting music, this upbeat little tune. I love this one too. You cannot be cranky. Is this summer? I think this is, is this spring or summer? I have to look. Summer. Nature's crescendo. There's a funny little TikTok about this one too. I, <laughs> I was gonna say I shared it, but I didn't. That was on my Facebook thing. <laughs> I love the summer music. Most lurkers don't want to even say they're lurking. Well, so, and sometimes they just can't. If they're at work or, they, you know, they have this on as background noise while they're doing housework, which is what I do a lot when I'm lurking. And that's fine. We love the lurkers. We love the chatters. We love the lurkers. We, we, we love the people who watch it later as a VOD. That's always nice, too. Everything helps. That's what's so great. Eh. Forgot you can't stack it on top of the bugs if they're too high. <laughs> can't wait to get a metal detector. Yeah, he has a lot of fun commands commit. I should just have him do a tutorial for me. Oh, Shelly! My goodness! Let me catch this fish. Thank you so much for the gifted memberships! That's very generous, very kind. You all are so very sweet. So nice, Lorianne got one, Angeli got one, Johnny Myers. Oh, Aaron got one. And Rebecca, thank you so much, Shelly. You're the best. And now I can see that my alerts, my other alerts are at least working this time. They don't always. Stream Elements is very temperamental. I've gotten in the habit now of just logging out of it and then back in before every stream just to kind of refresh it and hope it's going to be working. I really need to do a better alert too. <laughs> Thanks so much, Shelly. You're so sweet. I hope you had a good time on your camping trip. Okay, I need to put one of you down to save. Should mix up the area. I see the little underwater creature. I'm just not grabbing it. Cause... Well, I don't know why. I guess I can. Except this jellyfish is going to get me. <laughs> I wish we could set those down too with the other things to donate. Oh, thanks, Shelly. Best alerts are personal. I'll tell you what. <laughs> I agree. Let's sell some fishies and get some tickets. I'm going to need a lot for the frying pan. I really want the frying pan. I'll hold on to that. Shoot, you can have some nanners. We have to go talk to Fletch, too, and get the rest of our waddle. I'm going to save up for the frying pan. Ooh, up to 1400 nook miles. That's right. I'm going to still call him that.
Hi, Fletch. Did I ask John if I could do a favor? Probably not. I do need to get him up to four hearts for the recycle bin. I'm glad your dad would be proud, Fletch. Okay. Oh, Fletch doesn't count as a resident. Boo! <laughs> like, what the heck? That's just rude. Um, we'll put you in here for now. Same with that. We'll smelt that while we go, um, picking some more waddle. Probably just do a little more fishing so we can make some dinks. You make a crate and stick them in the crate. Yeah, I will as soon as I can make the crate. I'm going to... Oh, I have enough tin now that I probably can get the nails for it. I couldn't do it before. <laughs> I'm low on resources. And I love it. Oh, there's some tin. There. All right, any fishies? We'll be able to make Theodore really happy by gathering some things now, so he'll have... Oopsie, thanks for the museum when he arrives. Come on, Moxie, get it together. There we go. This is the music I love, too, from Stardew. The summer one. It's just fun and happy. Ichthyologist. Lovely. Oop. Fish catcher. Theodore is always next after John, isn't he? And then it's just... Random. Sorry, fish, I didn't mean to scare you. <laughs> squeaky hammer. Hopefully, James adds a clang or a bonk for the frying pan. Or squeaky hammer. Where did we just hear squeaky hammer recently? Whose stream was that? I'm trying to remember. It was adorable. That's gonna drive me nuts. Like, I'm trying to remember. I want to say it was during one of Ozzy's streams. Yeah, hopefully he adds the clang or a bonk. <coughs> Sorry for the frying pan. Yeah, that's the one we're all waiting for. Without using the power tools, does anyone know what's the most laborious basic tool to use? Oh, that was your stream commit. Ma yes, with Dave the Diver. Thank you. That was driving me bonkers. I mean, I feel like it's the pickaxe or, sh or, or axe, but the shovel could be too, Sherry. That's right. That was so funny in Dave the Dimer Diver. Did you ever use, because I had to leave your stream for a little bit. Did you ever get to uh, use the baseball bat on anything? Like, whap a shark on the nose or something? I was wondering what that would be for. The squeaky hammer was hilarious. That looked like a fun game.
Hi, Rue. I'm just jumping around with my fishing pole. Don't mind me. Fish. Rude. It looked like it was going to go for it on the land. That's hilarious. He's trying to get to it. Oh, I'm sweating. <laughs> oh, I'm exhausted. Exhaustipated. Yeah, if you all haven't, you should go check out Commit's Dave the Divers stream from Thursday. It was very fun. things for the museum. I'd like to get another one to sell. I'll have to sell them probably tomorrow. Well, maybe. We'll see how long it takes me to catch this fish and get back. <laughs> the first step is running the right direction. That always gets you to where you want to go faster. You don't think you did yet, but got good news for Thursday's game? <gasps> Won't announce it. Anything until right before? Ooh. Leaving us an with a little anticipation. Okay, keep one of you. Keep you. You're real. I th I no, we'll keep one of you. We'll keep one of you. Thanks, John. Thanks, John. Phew, just in time. <laughs> Not a lot of room around here. There you go. All right. I'm trying to think if there's anything else I really need to do. I think, yeah, I'm going to maybe just spend a little time fishing i do need to wrap this up because it's just getting harder and harder to not cough while i'm talking and it's just like getting really annoying so i'm sorry it's a shorter stream today but thank you guys so very much for starting out your monday with me and let me pull up again for anyone who who didn't see the start of the stream i'll show you kind of what i'm thinking of let me get this going in our browser here Here's kind of the plan. Um, I also have this up in Discord, so if anybody has any suggestions, I'm open to hearing them. But kind of what we're thinking of doing. Linus is easy, because that's the visitor's tent. And of course, John's store for Pierre's shop is really easy. We don't have anything like the medical clinic, so that's why I'm thinking the bank. Just the bank and John's shop right next to each other, I think will look okay. We're gonna have to dirt print a few, few of the buildings, because we don't have enough guest houses. You know, Sally and Clover's houses don't look at all right for what we need, but because Clover is the clothing store and Emily in Stardew Valley likes to sew, and that's who you get the sewing machine from, I thought it would be really fun to uh, put her shop there for Emily. So that's just to give you an idea of where we're headed. Oh, I'm glad I could entertain you on your lunch break, you guys. Thank you, everyone. Thanks, Sherry. I hope your day... It <laughs> goes well. Hopefully, yeah, this cough will just go away soon. I'm hoping when the hot weather comes, it'll go. 
Thanks, Nancy. Thanks, Ellie Jelly Commit, Shannon, everybody, Blue Sky, Ed Dog. I don't want to, I'll sound like Miss Marianne from Romper Room if I start saying everyone's names. But also, thank you so much for the gift sub, Shelly and Aunt Captain. We will talk to you all very soon. I am still planning on streaming tomorrow. I just don't know what time or for how long again because of the cough. But it will probably be another Dinkum stream. So I'm not going to do too much off stream. I'll just do a little fishing so I can have some dinks. And we'll see you all later. Thanks, Shannon. You have a great day, too. Bye, Isabel. Bye, everyone.